So, you've joined me at an interesting time. I'm currently being pursued by none other than a bunch of ants as they try and hit me with their elemental beams, but I've also got this self-destructive vulture charging along with them. Now, the reason I'm being followed by these guys is because I was doing a little bit of knocking out of dinosaurs down there by the beach just a second ago. And, um, well, there was a pack of four or five of them. I've taken down the others. Uh, these guys just are unrelenting and they won't leave me alone the problem is one is an explosive they're both alphas basically and uh if each, either of these guys get given the opportunity they will probably destroy me they'll decimate me and i can't really i don't want to give them that opportunity um i have the thickest though and the reason i'm kind of not just going in all guns blazing to kill them is one they're too strong for me but two um there is also a vulture that vulture that was kind of cruising around with them i don't know where he's gone but i really wanted to tame it up it was a self-destructive um basically are they still coming for me hold on a second they are they are i thought i lost them okay i guess not um i'll say hey spiritual oil jug bug how you doing up here not that i need you but you could actually be handy for me all right i literally gotta lose these ants we gotta get rid of them i gotta somehow lose their agriness i don't know why they're so angry with me or what i did to deserve it but i'm also running out of stamina so i better just land here but welcome back everybody welcome back sorry for the abrupt beginning but i just thought it was a good time to let you know my scenario and what i'm up to as you can see down there by the uh what are they where all this all these shenanigans began sorry just had a heart attack heard the explosion and kind of a little spooked um we have two dinosaurs currently schnoozing one of them is a summoner dinosaur which is one of the few basic tiers left that we need to tame and the other is a uh, banshee trilobite so it's a it's a beta uh, nightmare tiered dinosaur both of which we do need to add to our little egg laying collection which is why i've knocked them out i've currently got some of the kibble on me uh, but i don't have all of the kibble on me which is why really quickly i'm going to hop into my little kibble workbench thing and grab this one right here um but yeah if i could get rid of these ants it would be fantastic and if i can find that vulture wherever he has just disappeared to i think the last place i saw him was down here that would be even better there he is there he is there he is all right i'm gonna deal with him first i see you there buddy all right now i had previously thrown a net on this thing oh my goodness that i'll do with that in a second i had previously hit it with a net but then uh the ants came out of nowhere and you know decided they wanted to do some stuff to me um this is probably gonna explode in my face but let's just do it anyways and ping it's asleep okay good that's it all right nice <laughs> yes here is the unstable kibble my little dude and we've got ourselves a vulture nice um i won't bother about picking you up with that however nice little explodey feet and i can ride you what does it look like when we do this can we wait hold on before i do explode you will you just die and not i don't know if this thing re respawns after it explodes i literally hit the x button too or maybe it just explodes on death either ways um that's not that's it's self-destructive we should probably treat it with a little bit of care here it is an unstable dinosaur after all let's just send it up to our base and we'll worry about it in just a second <laughs> today though once these guys are tamed up i do want to head out and go looking for teams that can actually help us because right now it's really just us and this pteranodon and i want some other dinosaurs like that is an alpha self-destructive car oh my goodness but i want some dinosaurs that we can actually utilize uh day to day um there's only so long we can be living with a pteranodon it's only a matter of time before it dies and then hi what is your problem why are you doing that don't you roar at me like that gosh I thought he was going to attack me there for a second but we're okay um a treasure dilo all right, I actually need to be careful because there's just things around here and I, I don't really know what we're dealing with. But here, take that kibble. Good job, mate. And let's get you back to base before you like die or something. Um, you just dropped something? Or what happened there? What's this? Did I drop that? Chitin. Okay. I don't know where that came from, but sure. And then we've got a random dude over here as well who requires a summoner kibble. And that basically means that we have one more basic variant dinosaur to add to our collection um oh gosh come over here please i'm pretty sure the treasure dinosaurs are of the oh you didn't you didn't go back home all right hold on i just need to get this guy out of here 
um, because I am interested in that treasure dialo. I'm pretty sure they are of a variance though that if aggravated, like it'll make all the dinosaurs around us angry. And I, I just don't want to, I just want to make sure that we're good here. So it looks like this thing, oh, it's unique. This one here, it's tameable, gives the treasure hunter buff when killed. I don't know what that means, but let's find out. Um, while being, oh wow, this thing's got some crazy damage reduction. Yeah, that's what I thought. Look at, look, look, look. We've, just, we've just aggravated. Everyone's angry. <laughs> Everyone's angry. We got fireballs coming for us and everything. Dang it. I just needed to hit the thing a few times. That's all I needed to do. I wonder if, yeah, what, hold on. What is, what is actually shooting fireballs at me? A fire fireomia of all things. Okay. Good for you. Where did the dialogue? There he is. He's down here. Hold on. I'm going to try and scoop him up. Okay. There's actual things coming for us. I'm literally just going to pick it up and I'm going to carry it somewhere. Just kind of quiet and I'm just going to kill it up there. I don't know why I didn't think of this in the first place. I mean, I could probably just do this in my base. Nothing is going to come up here and attack us. Maybe those ants, maybe the ants actually, but um, let's just go right up the tippity top of this spot over here. There's a bunch of parasaurs. They're just non-variant. They're nothing. There's nothing special about them. Um, and we should be able to do this pretty cruisy up here. I don't know. In before something happens and goes completely wrong. Um, but what sort of health have you got? You don't have a lot. There's probably other ways I should be conducting myself here. But this just... I, I mean, I could even just net the thing. I've got like a net. Actually, I don't think they work on dinosaurs like this. But yeah, this is working. This is getting the job done. And every time we hit it, we're dealing more and more damage as we go. Which is part of our little rampage variant. And you're finished. We've killed a lucky dinosaur, which aren't that common. Now, we do have a little buff down the right-hand side, bottom of the screen. It says treasure. I don't actually know what that means, though. Um, maybe it, it means, like, if we go kill some stuff now, we might have extra treasure drop, maybe? Uh, I'm not too certain, but we've got five minutes of it, so we've got some time to check it out. Real quick, I am going to land back at base. And I am going to go and throw our new tames here into my machine. Uh, we have the random raptor. We've got a banshee trilobite and we got self-destructive vulture. Check them in. They are now despawned and inside of our machine, which brings our little egg chart. It's, it's, it's almost full. Utility, technically nightmare and elemental. We have nightmare. We've got a beta one anyway, so we don't really need that one there, but maybe I'll just do it for completion sake eventually. Um, fantastic. Okay. So now it's time for us to go see what we can actually do with this special lucky ability thing, I suppose. Uh, and I guess what I'm going to do is just look for some dinosaurs that we can maybe kill and see if we get treasure from them. Starting with poor little collective parasaur over here. No, don't go in the water. Oh no. Oh no. Did you die? Yeah, it did. Okay, good. Did you give me treasure? I don't know why I'm fighting you with that. All right. No treasure. Um, Okay, cut over here right now. Over here right now. Over here right now. Over here right now, dude. Was that this? Meteor moss chops? <laughs> okay then, sure thing, dude. Sure thing. I'm going to fight you. At least we can see meteors coming from a mile away. Um, yep. Whatever. I can, I can, I can best this little dude right here. I just need to listen out for any. Any explosions coming from above. Yep. And even when paying attention and knowing that we're going to come down, I still get caught in it, of course. As far as I can tell, no treasure. But that's fine. Uh, there is also an ultimate teleporter dialogue. No, thank you very much. Um, oh, man, I want, to, I want to take down these little ants, but it's probably not the smartest idea right this second. A beta summoner. I don't think I need to kill that. Oh, there's a little egg over here, though. What does this belong to? A self-destructive moss jobs. Is that this guy here? It is. I could tame you. I totally could. Um, but I'm not going to because I'm pretty low as it is. A disrupt a Lystrosaurus. Sure. Why not? But still, no signs of any treasure. Like I said, I don't actually know if this is how treasure things work. Um, but hey, you gotta you gotta learn these things, I suppose. We do have a loot dodo here, though. That's interesting. I'm going to take it. <laughs> I'm going to take and do exactly what we just did. Take it somewhere nice and safe where I can quickly kill this thing. If I do attack this, everything is going to get angry with me, which is why I'm taking it far away from anything. Maybe I should... 
Oh, I was going to say, I put a teleporter inside of the castle over there. And that can be like our little killing zone. The only thing is, um, it's not really going to work because you can't teleport wild dinosaurs. You actually need to tame them. But let me have a look at this little dude right here. Unique kill. So you can tame this, but it gives loot when it's killed. And I'm probably better off with the loot that we get when it's killed. Plus, we got the treasure buff, so maybe we can stack the two. Okay, he's coming to try and fight us back. That's cool. My rampage mode is, is stacking up now. That's what we want to see. And hopefully there's nothing nearby that catches on to what we're doing up here. And our illegal activities. Hi. Um, how you doing? I don't know where he came from, but we got loot. We got loot. We got loot. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Hey, buddy. Um, hey, I'll kill you too. I'll kill you too. While I'm in rampage mode. No, we're not in rampage mode anymore. We're cooling down now. Uh, but still, I could tame you. But I don't need to. You're healing. Dude, that's a little bit cheaty. Ah, right, you know what? It doesn't matter. I don't need to kill you. He's just going to respawn when I kill it anyway. That's what Phoenix dinosaurs do after all. Well, let's have a look at what we got from the loot thing. So we got a good stack of stuff here. Um, primitive getaway orb. This orb is used to summon a spiritual mount to get you out of a bad situation. The mount cannot be used for this uh, for combat and will disappear when dismounted or out of render. That is so cool. I'm going to hold on to that. That actually sounds very, very useful. Uh, we got two of those. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, we got some basic health potions. I think, yes, I will take those. A siren potion makes nearby enemies go passive and wander towards you for a short time. They go passive and they wander towards you. Interesting. We also got some stamina potions. I've got a knockout club. That's pretty basic. We got some mutton. It's pretty cool. Another, oh, primitive boomstick. Oh, I don't have one of those yet. That's different to this one. And I'll show you in a second why. Primitive slingshot. We got a primitive raptor saddle. We got, it's all pretty basic stuff. We got some knockout arrows. We've got a chitin chest piece. Some silica pearls. Um, what's this regular hatchet? Diabest saddle. I can break these things down. Some elements. Primitive heavy miners helmet. A spiritual potion. Ignores weight and stamina and you move faster for a full three minutes. That sounds cool. We got the immortal potion. It makes you immortal for 15 seconds. Why not? Some blue gems. We got a regular bow. We got some primitive gauntlets. Might actually might actually do something with those. Cooked fish, cooked meat. That's about it. Not terrible, but like not amazing either. Still really, really cool. Um, might as well take that, that, and that. And the rest of this, I'm not really interested in any basic blueprints. So I'm going to drop them. Okay. Well, I should probably drop some of this stuff back off at base. Um, but that's, I feel like a pretty lucky double whammy to encounter. A treasure dilo followed by a loot dodo. Um, two very unique dinosaurs. Uh, and now we have unique souls as well. So that's really cool. I don't know how the unique stuff works, but we're going to have to probably look into that. Um, I don't know why I'm in this inventory anyways. Let's go and drop our little souls off here. Probably not going to need these getaway orbs. I'm going to leave the stamina here. I'm going to leave the potions. I, I don't know. Maybe I should bring these with me. Um, yeah, let me just go and drop all this off. As I was just sorting through all of the stuff that we just obtained, I was like, I swear I got myself an elemental tame. And we did. It was the itchy. The itchy, the, the dolphin that I, I can't work out how to... I, I can't work out how to get inside of my little egg collector here. I, I have an idea we probably could try. It's probably not going to work, but this might be worth a shot. If I could get an Omni tool, if I grab this, if I basic transfer and I grab everything from there and put it in here, that's going to empty this, which you'd think would break it, but it's not going to. I'm going to pick up the egg collector and then I'm going to pick up a bed. I'm going to try and trick the game into thinking my base has moved. And I don't expect this to work at all because the developer of this mod is one of the smartest individuals, I think, in the whole Ark modding community. This mod is one of the most insane mods ever. It's pretty much rebuilt the entire game. So it's, it, there's no way he hasn't overthought this. But I'm going to basically try and trick the game into thinking this is my base by putting a bed here. By putting, no, it still doesn't let me place it. No way. This could totally be my base. How do you know it's not my base? We originally did this next to a raft. That raft was hardly a base. Is that what I just think it is? <gasps> Beta loot mesopithecus. All right, never do, no, never mind what we're doing here. That needs to die. That needs to die, more loot. Except this time, beta loot. The only thing is, 
This guy's not going to be so easily trapped. Uh, it's Mespithicus. It's going to run away. It's probably not going to engage us in battle. Uh, I need somewhere a little bit more stucky to get this guy stuck. Um, oh, hello. Hold on. We might be able to do it inside of this tree. No, there's no way. Oh, there's an artifact here. What? Okay. Don't run away, little dude. Don't run away. Um, hold on. I'm going to try and like, maybe. No, so close too. I was really, I was really hoping that would work. Um, no, where are you going? That's what I was worried about. Come back. Come back. It's too quick for me. <laughs> There's no way I could kill this. Hey, you throw a poop at me. Oh, 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 he said he's got rage mode on me. What is that? <gasps> Aberrant Ovis. Oh my goodness. I just one shot the thing. All right, come in here. Come in here. Come in here. Since you are. Oh, he's angry. Oh, he's angry. Okay. All right, cool. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Give me that extra loot. I don't have a lot of health, so I'm, this is kind of sketchy. But if I've got enough, I just I just need enough to get through this fight. That's all. Come back in this little hidey hole over here. Oh, he's in there somewhere. Is he? Uh, I think I'm stuck. We're all stuck. Okay, this isn't really working. <laughs> this isn't working at all. Oh, it's because I can't run backwards. That's what's up. But I'm, I'm, I'm hoping he's stuck in front of me. He definitely is not stuck in front of me. He keeps trying to escape. I don't appreciate that, little dude. Um, Am I going to die first here? Probably. Oh, I got like so little health. But I've got health potions. I've got health potions. All right, I'm keeping an eye on my health. He's trying to run away from me now, so that's good. We've got him halfway down, and I'm about to activate my ability again in about seven seconds. It looks like I've got him trapped. Okay, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. We should be getting some pretty sweet stuff out of this. Rampage, let's go. All right, this is going to speed it up a little bit. I can see our damage increasing. We're over 100. 140, 150. Let's go. Give me something good. Give me something good. This one here is a beta one. The last one was just a basic loot dinosaur, and there we go. There we go. All right, let's get disappointed. This probably ended up with absolute... Hey, 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 hey. All right. Beta stamina potion. Beta health potions this time around. This will... Okay, can I use this on my dinosaur? Because... He could do with a bit of a heal up. We got some veggies. We got some sap. I got a sniper rifle. I've got a summon a decoy. Okay, cool. We got a really amazing sickle. We've got another of these things. Huh. Oh, that's right. It's a unique weapon. Is this one a unique? This one isn't a unique. That's right. I forgot. We got like a special. It doesn't matter. We got another whip that we still haven't used up. We got an ele ele elemental resistance potion. We got some beer. We got a gun. We got some prime meat. We got some cementic paste. We got some oil. We got some beta arrows. Uh, we got a, another mining helmet. That's pretty cool. And a shotgun. And I don't think I'm going to be using... Ooh, hello. A journeyman net gun. I doubt this thing is any better than our regular primitive one. But it's still cool to see. Fishing rods. We got a trophy ignathosat. That actually, maybe I'll keep that just in, but just in case. Just in case. Um... I think that's it. I don't think... I can't see us using... Oh, Quadladon saddle. I do want to team up one of these four-headed things. All right. I think I think we'll just drop the rest of this. Sweet. That's good. That's really good. Oh, and while I'm here, may as well grab the artifact as well. At least now I know whenever we need an artifact, we just fly right up behind our base and come and grab it. I don't know if this mod relies on artifacts at all, but in the instance that it does... We now know where to get them. So I guess the cool thing about getting some of this random loot is we can break it down for its resources. I don't plan to use a fabricated pistol, for example. So salvage it. I don't plan to... Well, we've got a whole bunch of these sickles now. May as well salvage them. Um, we got two whips. And I don't know which one we keep. I assume the unique one is better than the Mastercraft one. Uh, Violent whip that has 10% chance to enrage the attacker. Enough to make everything in the area wanted dead. Like, that actually sounds really cool but i'm gonna break it and i'm gonna hope we get some pretty cool loot out of it hey seven souls <laughs> nothing crazy but good enough um we've also got the journeyman fabricated so i'm gonna keep this just in case but i don't plan to use a miner's helmet so give me those resources baby uh, oh and a shotgun yeah we'll salvage that too yeah we got some pretty sweet loot and now it's time to go and test some of this stuff out because I really want to do that. All right. So let's go find some test dummies. A fire fiomia prime st You know what? Fire fiomia sounds pretty damn good. I don't know what I'm going to test on this guy just yet. But I'm going to do something with it. Maybe I'll whip it. 
Definitely not going to whip a prime stone for you, Omir, but this guy here. Uh, <laughs> yep, I should have known he was going to fire a fireball at me. But look at this. We've made... Actually, that did a lot of damage. Did it do a lot of damage? I think it did. Um, and... Oh, now the ants are coming for me. Go away, ants! No, I'm not looking to rampage mode. I'm just trying to evacuate the area. Obsidian tech parasaur. All right. What else we got? We got a dodo over there. And we've got an earth compy. All right. What happens if I do... That thing looks sick. What happens if I do... the? Ouch! I think my... My damage resistance is actually... It's holding up pretty good, this new armor that I've kind of crafted up. Um, things were meant to fight you, though, dude. Things were meant to fight you. Oh. Oh, no. Go. <laughs> uh, I don't know what... Oh, there's a beta compi. Comet compi, rather. That actually sounds really cool. Let me go and... Well, I was meant to go and burn them up a little bit there, but it didn't really work out. How strong are you? Oh, you got 12,000 health. Please don't summon a comet on me, because that would really hurt. Um, I shouldn't be fighting it like this, but... All right, there's, there it is. We knew it was coming. Thanks for that, buddy. Appreciate it. And now it's time to test out our other ability. The primitive boomstick. Um, this... <laughs> this looks dangerous. I hope this is... I, I, oh, man. I hope I don't look back on this moment and regret this, but... Right-click to light the fuse. And then... And then... Okay. Can I... Can I unlight the fuse now? Okay, we can. Good. Okay, I was waiting for an explosion to go off and it didn't happen. Um, jug bug. Let's light the fuse. You. <laughs> no, 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 you weren't meant to escape. All right, turn the, turn the fuse off. I'm just glad this isn't like really hurting me right now because that's actually <laughs> pretty cool. Um, okay, I want to test this on something a little stronger, but I can't see five feet in front of me, which makes things that really, it makes things really difficult. All right, this poor Triceratops is... Uh, is our next test dummy. Although there is a Comet Pteranodon. Light it up, baby. Let's go. Bam. Bam. Explode. Yes. Just don't summon a Comet on my face, please. It's pretty good. It's not like crazy damage, but for like a little melee attack. I mean, it's pretty fantastic. I just need more explosions. More explosions. More explosions. More explosions. Thank you. I think we finally found a dinosaur that's actually damaging me because the rest of the dinosaurs today that I've tried really haven't put much of a dent in me. This guy, however, is. Um, oh man. Where's the... I'm waiting for the explosion to pop off. Yeah, there we go. All right, you know what? Instead, let's go for the whip. Dude, that deals more damage. Look how much damage the whip does. I can like rapid fire this thing too. This is so good. That is so cool. There's a feather light over here. Whip. Whip. I can't hit a target. I can't hit it. No. Damn you, feather light. Oh, you made a mistake just now, buddy. Watch here. Watch here. Watch here. Yeah. Get wrecked. I don't know what I had against that feather light, but it's dead. You too, Dilo. You too. Dude, this thing is amazing. How have I been sleeping on this whip? This is the unique one, by the way. The one we've had for like a week. Not the, not the other one. This thing's actually insanely powerful. I feel stupid. There's a, I just looked at a crocodile. I don't know where it is, but it's out here somewhere. Kind of nerve wracking to say the least, but I think we've passed it. So that's all right. It's not going to sneak up and attack me or anything. Oh, if I needed a resource dinosaur, that would have been amazing. But we don't need that anymore. A nuclear Lystrosaurus. Oh my goodness. Uh, that doesn't sound pretty. But I'm going to do something silly and attack it and then run away. And then I'm going to... I was meant to attack it as I flew over the top of it and I failed to do it. Attack it again. Unstable souls aren't the easiest things to come across. So when you get them or when you find them, you, you, you take them. Um, a beta vampire trilobite. I don't need you because I'm pretty sure I just tamed one a little earlier. But I'll give you a little... I'll give you a little whip. I love this thing. When it does damage, which... All right, now it's not doing amazing damage. But this is so much better than my boomstick. And then... Excuse me? Hey. Oh, snap. That is a prime. That is a prime. That is a prime, I repeat. I am attacking something with 100,000 health. No, thank you very much. Let me get myself out of here. A what? A demon. Okay. Uncontrollable carbo, too. Yeah, there's a few dangerous dudes out here that... 
I should be avoiding. Oh man, this is what we need, except like the, the last dinosaur I need to, to complete the basic tier is a utility dinosaur. And we have, nope, that's a summoner. This guy here, utility, would be perfect, except it's a beta. I just need a regular old basic utility dinosaur. And I'd be so happy if I could find one right this second, but I don't know, I feel like it's gonna be a little difficult. Ah, uh -huh. hold on, hold on. <laughs> I take that back. We found what we're looking for. Uh, unfortunately, there's a prime knockback compy. There's a prime psychosis must chops. Uh, we got some dodos, that's fine. The banshee compy over there. But this parasaur right here is exactly what we need. And this compy, yeah, like I said, he's going to come and fire me. Thun oh, it's a thunderstorm trilobite as well. Um, that thunderstorm trilobite, I was actually kind of intrigued about, though. That could be handy. I don't know which one it is. And o an omega zombie. Oh, gosh. All right. If I can get this parasaur, though, this is like the final, it's the final thing we need. These compies, though, I can see them running through the water. The load range on these dinosaurs is actual crazy. One of these I could kill. That's not going to be good for me though. I'm totally going to die right now. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Um, prime knockback compy. West he's going to do is knock me back. It's fine though. I'm not going to give him the opportunity to do that. Somebody dropping fireballs out there too. All right. I got to lead, lead these things astray and then I'll come back for the parasaur. All right. Well, this, the, the compy's decided to stop chasing. I'm sure they're going to change their mind in a second when I land over here, but we're just going to cross our fingers and... Hope that that's not the case. We're looking pretty safe for the time being. I shouldn't need to do much here other than... Other than net this thing, which I just failed at doing somehow. Let's try that again. Bam. All right. Uh, we shouldn't need a lot of arrow power here. All right. He's asleep. There we go. Didn't need to do much. Let's give it that little piece of utility kibble that I got sitting here in my inventory. And then take a step back because I don't want this thing to get killed mid team or anything like that. And I haven't really done my due diligence to see what's like around us. So, sorry, buddy. But uh, you asked for that, I think. And that's a different parasaur. Okay, good. <laughs> I got a little scared there for a second. Um, there was something else down here that I that caught my attention. The U, the thunderstorm trilobite. Okay, I actually could possibly i could tame you wait no you're a nature dinosaur i don't need you sorry i thought a thunderstorm would be a good elemental i don't need it though that's fine this guy i don't have i could no you're a male i don't need you and a stone trilobite i don't need you either there is the parasaur though and we finally have ourselves the entire basic tier complete sort of Yes, Rampage. Good for you. But um, no, that's it. Other than the... Was it the Nightmare tier? We skipped one of them. But we don't need to go back. Yeah, it was the Nightmare. We skipped one. Doesn't matter. We don't need to undo that. Um, and that is because we already got the beta tier of it. Let's throw this poor dude down. And I say poor dude because unfortunately for them, they are about to get sucked into my machine here. Bada bim, bada boom. Just like that. Oh. Oh, the elemental. That's right. I still got to find a way to get my itchy thornus in here. But uh, there's no water up here at the base. So, yeah. Don't know how I'm going to do that. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. We're going to end this one right here tomorrow. Well, maybe I actually will tame some dinosaurs to use like I was meant to. We'll see how it goes. But until then, keep smiling. Have a fantastic day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.